So Black Friday is here. We literally have two last days. If you're looking to lose up to 20 to 30 pounds of fat and gain some quality lean muscle over the next 90 days, make sure to click that first link in the description. Don't miss out. This is a once in a lifetime opportunity. If you're serious, if you're ready to invest and you want to get up to 50% off and get great results over the next 90 uh, to 120 days, let us know. First link, apply now. So after helping literally so many people uh, within our online coaching, uh, we've learned that a lot of times people like to overcomplicate things and especially like I don't blame them because online when you search on Google, cardio this, fat loss this, there's so much information. And my simple answer for this, what seems to be a complex question is prioritize what your main goal is first when you have the most amount of energy, okay? The only time I truthfully spend um, a lot of time prioritizing cardio beforehand is if cardio is my main objective. So recently, a couple months ago, I was getting prepared for a half marathon, so I would always do my eight to 10K run, then come into the gym because my strength training goal was secondary. I always had that half marathon goal first, then strength training, but now, that I'm out of running and right now it's getting colder here. I'm focusing more on strength training, focusing on building a better physique. I'm gonna take my cardio, bring it for later on and do my strength training first, okay? I think the only time you'd ever put cardio beforehand is when you really do want to prioritize that and that's your main objective to perform better, to get faster and to just overall improve your anaerobic and aerobic training systems. However, I would say for the majority of people who are looking to just overall lose fat, become healthier, become fitter, that strength training will always come beforehand, okay? And that's just my opinion. Strength training, in my opinion, will always trump cardio when it comes to just overall building a better physique, getting in better shape. And a lot of times people think that cardio is always gonna be number one, and then they never even make it to the strength training side of the things, or they'll spend four hours or two hours or one hour doing cardio, and then they're like, okay, that's good enough, but they never got their strength training in. So how I would do it, for any person, probably about 95% of people, is a three to five minute warm up on a treadmill, on a bike, on a rowing machine, go do strength training, and if you wanna do cardio, you can do it after your workout, or you can do it later on in the day, um, if that makes sense. But that's just it, uh, hopefully this makes sense. If you have any questions, comment down below. We are the number one online coaches. We've helped transform over a thousand people to date, and a lot of it doesn't have to be that hard. When we do this for every single person, we focus on straightforward nutrition, hypervantage training, as as well as have it all coaching which is basically our nutrition system our training system and our accountability system and within this triangle you will get great results we're looking for three people who want to take it to the next level who want to lose 20 to 30 pounds of fat in the next 90 days hit that first link if you want to apply and be the next success story and we'll see you in the next video peace